Okay, this week we'll be doing a how-to video on bow ties because it's been requested or asked for by our followers, so here it is. But before I get started, I just want to say, I don't know if you noticed in the past year or so, but there's been like a bow tie craze, and it's fine and all, but the problem is that 90% of those bow ties are clip-ons. Now, clip-on anything are unacceptable. They're just not fashionable. You can argue with me all you want, but at the end of the day, you will lose. So stop wearing them. And, I mean, there's really no excuse. I'm about to teach you how to. And if this doesn't work, there's about a thousand others on YouTube that can teach you how to. So, um, well, when you buy your bow tie, it usually comes with sizes. If you see them, those are your neck sizes. I'm a 15 and a half, but I bump it up to 16 because these sizes don't account for the shirt. So, it's usually, I just put a half a size on. So, when you get started, bind your, your shirt all the way up, just like a tie, as if you're going to do a tie. Alright, All right. and you'll do, you'll make your left side shorter than your end, see, something like that. Now put your right side over your left, like this, short side on the bottom. Bring up your right side or the long side up through the middle and squeeze. Now make sure you tighten it properly on this because you won't be able to tighten it anymore afterwards, this step. So have it tight enough so it doesn't dangle but not too tight that, that it's choking you. So now you have the small side. On the small side you bring your pointer finger onto the back and bring up the flap. So now you have half a bow tie like this. All right, hold your bow tie and bring this side over. All right. Now, now fold both flaps over the long side like this, and you should have a hole back here. And if you see it, all right, there's a hole in here. All right. Bring this long, push the long side in through that hole. Don't push it all the way through, just half of it, you know. So now you have somewhat of a bow tie. But you should have four flaps. I don't know if you see them. There's one, two, three, four. Now when you tie in your bow tie, you do opposite ends. So I'm going to do back right and front right, right, and then the same thing. Now this step might take a while, but you have to keep doing it until the bow tie is sort of even. I mean, you'll never get a perfect bow tie, but... I try to get it as close as possible, you know, kind of OCD about it, but. So I just keep doing it until, whatever, it's going to take a while, but if you can notice, the bow tie is pretty even. Um, then you just pop down your collar. Oh, another thing, like, once you learn how to do the bow tie, you don't have to have your collar popped. To tie them. I just did it for the video so you guys can see it better. So there you have it. There you go. Stop wearing clip-ons. No excuses. If this one doesn't help. Like I said, there's a bunch of more videos. There's even diagrams on Google if you Google for them. So yeah, check out our Instagrams at Teaching Men's Fashion and thank you for watching.